It's always those cases in the news you hear that are just horrible stories, but they hit home. Like some of them they just they hit you harder than others, you know. And that the um, Gabriel Fernandez, he was an eight-year-old boy from Palmdale. Killed by his mom and his mom's boyfriend in 2013. You know, years go by. I think the dad got the death penalty and the mom got life. But there's just like absolutely no remorse. The shit they did to that kid, man. He was beat and tortured for months. An eight year old boy had a crack school, his teeth knocked out, man. And that dude had the fucking audacity to stand there like he's hard in his fucking... Man. If you kill an eight-year-old and you go to prison... Man, don't be fucking mean-mugging in your goddamn picture. Joke, man. And the mom, she basically told on both of them. She said they both, you know, were culpable. And it will be 16 years old right now, man. I think he would have been a good kid, man. He had to... There's a picture of him with two black eyes, man. And he's holding up some award. He's giving it to his mom. The person that gave him them black eyes, man. Just unconditionally love for it. he had for his mother. Fucking locked him in a kitchen cabinet and shit. If he didn't clean the cat box good enough, they made him eat what was never left. And they f that's true because they found cat litter in the fucking kid's stomach, man. Always beat him down. Call him a fag. This kid was let down at so many levels, man. And through all this, like four social workers lost their job. As long as there's gonna be throwaway people, people they think for whatever reason, they're poor, they're on drugs, they're this, they're that, for whatever reason, you think you're better than somebody because of them? There's always gonna be fucking people like this. If it was Friday, they didn't wanna fucking do nothing because it was Friday. Everybody wanted to go home. The kid was like showing his arms like secretly to security. The, the security guard at the school, he fucking, he went all out, man. He tried. The teacher, I think, even tried. But the so I think the social workers, everybody involved in this, man, should fucking lose their job and never. Listen, if you get into that kind of job, whatever it be, man, do your fucking job, man. Yeah, his mom and boyfriend beat that kid to death. But there's so many more people that should be fucking, you know, held responsible for his death. He didn't have to die. I had a son who was, he's 29, so he was five years older than Gabriel, so he was, but I remember when he was a little boy and, That's why that picture was so hard, man. Two black eyes. Just happy to give that fucking award to his mom. His piece of shit mom. If they're in a front row seat in hell for these motherfuckers, you know, what girl or bad could beat an eight-year-old kid? What mother could get an eight-year-old kid? Man, if my old lady would have fucking even seen me spank my kid, she would have probably fucking gone crazy. Don't forget Gabriel, man. Or the thousands of kids that are like him get put in fucking just, shh, just life deals with a fucked up hand, man. 
life dealt that kid a bad hand. Who knows what he could have grown up to be. At least he got away from that fucking miserable ass fucking mom and boyfriend, but still. I was a loyal little kid, man. He knew what loyal was. He was still loyal to his goddamn mother. Four people lost their job. cops 60 times 60 times they were called 59 times they reported it it was nothing the law gets out of jail for fucking beating that other kid no big deal send Gabriel back to her I can't even comprehend. Who could do something like that? To any eight-year-old child, let alone your own flesh and blood. It's just sad. And I guarantee you, Gabriel's looking down saying, man, Forgive his mom. I guarantee you he is. I wouldn't forgive the bitch. I hope she gets the hell and fucking Satan sticks a pineapple up her ass. That's what I hope. And that dude acting all hard. You ain't hard, man. You fucking knocked out an eight year old kid's teeth, cracked his skull. I couldn't even look at the fucking autopsy photos, man. This fucking poor little body was just ravished with fucking cigarette burns, old healing cigarette burns. I'll never understand that, man. Fuck those dirtbags in jail, man. Remember Gabriel. Kid had his life snuffed away. Cause some fucking skag didn't like her life. If you don't want to have kids, use fucking protection. Fucking morons. It's just maddening. On so many levels.